during the ten days from Rosh Hashanah until Yom Kippurim, we pray. The main thing that we are doing is to pray. We change something in the tefillah during all the days, and we have special tefillah on the two days of Rosh Hashanah and the day of Yom Kippurim. One thing very special we can see in the tefillot of the ten days. We say, instead of Ha'el HaKadosh, we say HaMelech HaKadosh, the Holy King, HaMelech, the King, the Holy. It means that we praise Hashem and we accept His Kingdom. Hashem is the King of the Kings. And also Rosh Hashanah in the Tefillah. We say in the, in the middle of the third Beracha, V'timloch atahu Hashem elokeinu meera al kol maasecha. We ask Hashem, please, you have to show your kingdom on all the world, all the world. And then in the second, the second thing, in the middle Beracha, we say, אלוקינו ואלוקי אבותינו, מלוך על כל העולם כולו בכבודך. Please, you have to be the king of all the world. Please, you have to show it to the people in the world that you are the king. Every day we say, יכירו וידעו כל יושבי תבל. We have, we want that uh, all the people around the world, not only Jewish people, all the people will, will recognize and will accept the kingdom of Hashem. So it's our mission. The Jewish people started it since Avraham Avinu. Avraham Avinu, he was praising Hashem every, every place. He used to go, people were worshiping idols. And Avraham Avinu told them that there is a king. Hashem is the king. God is the king. It was the mission of Abraham Avinu. It, and it is the mission of Am Israel during the old generations. We accept Torah, mitzvot. We do it and the goyim, all the people in the world, they see the Jewish people and many after us, they worship Hashem. They accept, they recognize Hashem and they Accept the kingdom of Hashem. So Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur, we ask Hashem to open their eyes and we want all the world to accept the kingdom of Hashem. I want to say a short story about that. But before, if someone passed away, we say Kaddish. What is the meaning of the Kaddish? It's in Aramic. But the meaning of the Kaddish, the first half of the Kaddish, it's to praise Hashem. It gadal ve'it kadash shemei rabba. It will be great and the holy, the name of Hashem. And we praise Hashem. Only we speak about that. We don't mention the soul of the one that passed away. When we say Hashem is a king and we praise Hashem, it means that Hashem will save his soul. He will protect him. So there is a story, a short story. Uh, about 150 years ago in Russia, the Russians government, they used to send people to kidnap children, Jewish children. Six years old, seven, eight years old, they used to kid kidnap them, to take them far away and to make them soldiers and they used to send them to the war. Many died. All, all the children that survived, they, they caught all the connection with the family, with the Judaism. When they became 50 years old, they released them. They opened for them special places to live and gave them a small salary until they passed away. 
And uh, it's a famous story, very sad story that happened to Am Israel in Russia. We call that children Cantonists, Cantonists. So one rabbi uh, was one Yom Kippur with that people, Cantonists. And they have special place, they open it for Yom Kippur. And he went, he saw many people, old people, sad people, people that hardly could smile, and uh, praying, they were praying quiet. Yom Kippurim, before Neila, one of them said, wait a minute, before we pray Neila, I remember when I was a child that the rabbi used to say a speech before Neila. Anyone wants to say a speech? One of them said, yes, I want to say something. And he said, Ribbono Shel Olam, our God, every Jewish people, I know they pray today for three things. Banim, Chaim, Mezonot. The people pray for children, for life, and Parnasa, money. So Hashem, for Children, we cannot pray for you because it's too late. We know we will never have children. Chaim, life, our life is so bad, we don't need this life. Parnasa, we get small salary, we don't need any more. So, Ribbono Shalom, we don't ask you for that. What we ask you, we ask you one thing. You will be great, Ribbono Shalom. We pray for you. You will be great. Yehi Ratzon, Sheit Gadal, Veit Kadash, Shemei Rabbah.